Hello everyone, how are you going today? I hope you're all doing really well. In today's video, I'll show you how to get started on one of the most upcoming and popular launch pads, Red Kite. I'll go through the process step by step and, and you'll easily know what needs to be done in order to participate in projects early in the initial DEX offerings or IDO process before they get listed on exchanges. So if you're interested in that, then smash that like button, subscribe and activate the notification bell, then hold on to your hats for today's tutorial. So firstly, in order to participate in RedKite's IDO, you'll need to get the PKF token or Poker Foundry token. You can see this here on CoinGecko. Currently it's trading at around $1.50 and if you scroll down in CoinGecko, you'll be able to find where to buy it. Uh, there are some central exchanges and of course it is also on Uniswap. You'll need to use an Ethereum network and to get this to get this but most of the IDOs will take place on the Binance Smart Chain and you'll be able to pay with those with BUSD. So in the future transactions will be a lot cheaper. Before we buy it though let's check out the tiers and find out the benefits of each tier and decide which one would best suit us. Basically there are four tiers Dove, Hawk, Eagle and Phoenix. Each tier is based on a minimum amount of red kite points which is determined on a one-to-one -one basis with PKF token. So for example Dove minimum stake amount is 500 red kite points or 500 PKF tokens. Hawk is 5,000, Eagle is 40,000 and Phoenix is 80,000. Basically the higher the tier the more allocation you get. Both the Eagle and the Phoenix tiers have guaranteed allocation. Let's just go to their site and check out about how many, how often and how successful their token sales have been in the past. Looks like they are releasing around four or five projects a week, which is extremely busy. Let's pick out a few random ones and see how they've been performing in the past IDOs. All right, so Monster Clan price was 15 cents per Mons token. Investing was 34% at TGE or token generation event, which means when the token is listed on the exchanges and 33% each of the remaining two months. Currently, Mons is trading at 41 cents, and that is around 2.5x. Revolve Games' IDO price was 10 cents for RPG token, and vesting was 25% at TGE, and the rest over three months. Currently, RPG is trading at 41 cents, so that is around 4x. Sin City IDO price was two cents per Sin token, investing was 25% at TGE, and the rest over three months. Currently, Sin is trading at 28 cents, so that is around 14x. By the way, you'll notice I chose all play to earn gaming IGOs. Truth be told, they mainly list those kinds of projects. The good thing is though that those kind of projects have been performing very well in recent times. Just go through the calendar and view and check them out for yourselves. So if you think Red Kite might be a good launch pad for you, I recommend just getting in at the lowest tier first. Check out um, if everything is working smoothly and just, uh, it just plays to be safe. Another thing too, um, you'll need to do KYC through BlockPass to be eligible to join any of the IDOs. Okay then, so step one, buy some PKF tokens. So just connect your wallet to the Ethereum, to Ethereum network and go to their website at regkite.pokerfoundry.com and click on buy PKF. And that, and that will take you over to Uniswap where you'll be able to purchase however much you want. Next, you'll need to stake your PKF token, enough to qualify for one of the tiers I mentioned earlier. So just click on the staking link and you'll be given three choices. You'll get a higher APR if you lock up your PKF tokens longer. Uh, they've even added a third option of 30% APR, lock up for 180 days, but that option doesn't allow you to enter IDOs, which is kind of strange. 
Just to be on the safe side, I'd probably go for an eight day lockup. Uh, you won't get as much APR, but the, if the market dumps, you'll you'll be able to have the ability to move your capital a lot quicker. Up to you, of course, not financial advice. Okay, so once you have your PKF in your wallet, you just need to click on stake and you're done. Step two, uh, so you'll need to complete your KYC uh, to be eligible for the IDOs. So just click on my account, my profile, and then you can check your status. If you aren't verified, click on KYC now, KYC now button, and then just follow the directions onto BlockPass. Step three, apply for the upcoming IDO. Just go to the main page and click on view all projects. Make sure you're connected to the BSC network, not the Ethereum network, because most of the projects you'll find are on BSC these days, and that's due to Ethereum being a little bit too expensive. Okay, so then click on the IDO, which, uh, which you would like to participate in. Fill out all the information, like Twitter ID, Telegram ID, follow the projects on Twitter, and join the Telegram groups too. Now click Submit. You'll need to sign that on your wallet for a gasless transaction. Okay, so you can check if this has, has gone through by clicking on My Pools. Okay, so it seems that's gone through. You can now you can also join the community pools if you wish. Uh, in this case, you might be given a few more Gleam tasks to complete. All right then, I think that's pretty much all you need to know. Uh, just from my experience so far, all I can say is that for sure there are many, many quality IDOs being launched on RigKite. But to be honest, if you allocate just enough for the Dove tier, you probably won't get in many at all. Honestly, I've been doing this for 90 days now, and I've only ever got one allocation for all that time in Dove tier. So it probably won't, uh, won't be worth it if you do that. So to make it worthwhile, I'd probably go for one of the higher tiers next time. All right then, I hope that has given you a better insight into Red Kite's launchpad. If you found this useful, please smack me a like, subscribe, and be sure to comment if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye for now.